Hi, today we're going to be uh, drawing a mitten. We just listened to the story, uh, One Mitten. Okay, and so we are going to start by tracing our hand so that it can be the thighs of our hand. And we're going to draw an oval around. We're not going to draw um, the, the fingers. So we connect right here, and then we add a curved line, a curved line, and connect. Once you're done drawing your mitten, Next, we are going to add lines, okay? And so we're gonna make a pattern. We're gonna start every by adding a horizontal and we're gonna start with a zigzag line. All we're doing is adding all the lines that we've learned from the beginning of the school year. Next, I am going to do a dotted line. Okay, and then we add another horizontal line and we are going to draw a broken line. Okay, next a horizontal line and then a bumpy line. Okay, horizontal line and then we are going to do a curvy line like a snake. Okay, we add another horizontal line. Next we are going to add some diagonal lines. Diagonal lines are the ones that are slanted and look like they're falling. Okay. And then we connect, we add our horizontal line. Next, we are going to draw, um, let's go ahead and start all lower so we can use some repetition. We'll do a six stack line again. Okay, and then we just repeat the lines that we have. So next it will be our dotted line. Okay, we continue another horizontal line our broken line, then our bumpy line, and last our curvy line. Okay, and so we have a pattern of lines. Okay, we can even add some a little pattern on our the bottom section of our mitten. Okay, once we have that we are going to be drawing some snowflakes, making it seem as if our hand is going up to catch some snowflakes. So we're just gonna draw about two large snowflakes and then some little snowballs, okay? So it's like a plus and an X. And then on the edge of each line, I'm gonna do a little circle. And in between the lines, I'm gonna draw like a little triangle. Okay, we're going to draw again this side, plus sign, X, circle, and then our triangle in between each line. Okay, now I'm going to draw some circles for the snowball. Some are bigger. Some are smaller, some are closer. Okay, and so once you're done drawing your circles, you're gonna go ahead and color it, and you can do a pattern of colors as well. Thank you.